How's it going everybody? I am ScruffyTuba, and we are starting up with Devil May Cry, or DMC, um, which was a prequel or a reboot? I think it's a prequel. Pretty sure it's a prequel to um, the other Devil May Cry games. A younger, more... Um, I was going to say more cocky, but Dante is pretty cocky anyway. But a younger Dante. Alright, we're going to play just Devil Hunter, because... That seems like medium difficulty enemies use core attacks and do moderate damage. Yup, let's do that. Because I'm not going to fight with playing super hard mode. Anyway, for those of you that don't know, don't know what Devil McCry is, it's basically a um, rhythmic uh, combo heavy based slash attack kind of game. Combo heavy. Very, very, very combo. Lots of combos. Cutscene. It's pretty. It's a pretty game, too. Yes, by close of trading Friday. Of course, I forgot to put on subtitles. No, you can't have more time. You know the terms, you know the consequences. No, this is not a veiled threat. That's a nice... This is a direct one. Nice head Should you fail there. to comply, the collapse of the economy will be on your head. I will make sure that you are the stripped fuck of is power, that thing? shamed, and hated. I mean... Is that clear enough She's so pretty. Well, Friday it is, then. You have a good night, Mr. President. Why was Mr. President talking to Mr. Clean? So, did you get it, my darling? Over he must a be a powerful guy. Oh. Soon I will own everything worth owning. Hmm. I will control the world through debt. I have absolute power. <laughs> the world is at last your bitch, as am I. Nothing left but to grab it by the hair, bend it over, and... <sighs> What's the matter? Just getting chills what's, thinking what's about that. A loose end. A loose end? What? The son of the traitor Sparta. Dante. Him. He's still out there. The hunters will find him. They found Sparta in his war. And when they do... I... will rip open his chest with my bare hands and feast. On his beating heart. Sounds like a nice balanced breakfast. Oh, that's an intro. And there's Dante and his mother there on the loading screen. Well, I'm ready to kick ass. The demons have been increasing their power for millennia. They're on the verge of controlling mankind. Citizens, we've been kept asleep in a manufactured illusion for too long. We must wake up. The mass lunatic you saw there claims to represent an organization called the Order. Time to wake up, Dante. Has claimed responsibility for several serious attacks in recent weeks. He is undoubtedly a traitor and a terrorist. And I, for one, am not for the death penalty. Oh my god, this is actually, uh, Wolverine. Must be another origin story. This is Bob Barbus, just doing that. Dante, get out of there, you're in danger! I'll wake up every morning. Probably should have put on some pants. You were careless. You left a trail. Now he's on to you. What are you talking about? Who's on to me? The hunter demon. <gasps> he's here. Oh man, that is one sexy son of a bitch. He's dragging you into limbo. Let him take me. Let him get down with him. 
fight your way out. Fucking hate when that happens, man. Don't you hate it when you go to uh, the fair and suddenly it becomes limbo? Shit. Back in limbo. Bad day for a hangover. Could you at least put pants on? Get your filthy fucking claw off my trailer. Yeah. Aw, oh, son of a bitch. I knew I should've got, uh, the way I get dressed in the morning copyrighted. That's just bullshit. Capcom owes me money. Missed. Aw, oh, cute. Yes, sir. Whoop. That'll work. That's not what I was trying to do. I was trying to do the death coil combo. This two. There we go. Oh, yeah. Very heavily combo based, as you can see. This game is fucking awesome, though. This is the combo based hack and slash. Red Orb! New item found. Red Orb. Slain enemies release red orbs, which can be spent at the item shop on consumables, health upgrades, and more. A white orb! Slain enemies released. <coughs> Slain enemies release white orbs, which can fill, which fill Dante's upgrade bar. What the fuck is wrong with me? Each time the bar is filled, Dante can unlock a new ability via the upgrade shop. Oh yeah, that's how it's done. Oh yeah. Oh uh, yes, ghost lady of my dreams. Come back here. There's Ebony and Ivory. Dante's infamous pistols. Oh shit, okay. Before I forget again, let's. Let's actually turn everything out a little bit there and uh, put on subtitles so it's easier to hear me and you can read things. No escape my ass. I'm getting the hell out of here. I'll make my own escape. Oh shit, I almost fell there. Oh god. Oh, I'm not, I'm not gonna make it. Oh, I'm gonna make it. I'm gonna make it. I'm gonna make it. I'm gonna make it. Holy crap, that was close. Ebony, Ivory, Mr. Goats. That did some damage. It's kind of like a facial. Battles. Target practice. Right on cue. It was good timing, actually. Ebony and Ivory. X to shoot. High killer handguns capable of maintaining high rates of fire against a single target. Though they deal low damage, Ebony and Ivory are useful for interrupting weak enemy attacks. Good to know. It's also a good way to string together combos. From my experience. Oh, I should probably not get hit by shit. Yep, yep, this completely defies all laws of gravity, but fuck it, I will stay in the air by shooting my guns upwards. That makes sense. Oh well, he's Dante, does what the fuck he wants, he's Nephilim. Oh god. There's bombs everywhere. Damn it! Ha 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 ha! Whoop! 
Nope. Nope. Okay, it's gonna take me a little bit to get used to the buttons again. This, uh... I mean, there's not that many buttons, but there are a lot of combos. And, uh, you don't actually get them all right away. You progress through the game and unlock combos as you go along, but after a while, it does get really um, intense and complicated. There we go. It's Silverfish, arcade game. Don't think I've ever heard of that. And... Giant enemy, giant enemy, giant enemy crabs. That's a good reference for those of you that don't know the reference. You should go look it up. Dante, don't shoot. My name is Cat. I'm not a demon. I'm still in the real world. You're in limbo. How come I can see you clearly? I'm a medium, a, a psychic. I can phase into limbo and communicate with you. I'm liking those Tomb Raider shorts. You, talk to you, but I'm not actually in limbo with you. If I pull the trigger, I'll die. I'm risking my life here for you. I want to help. I don't need your help. The hunter has dragged you into but limbo. I, knew, I do need that ass. I've been down here before. I know how to get out. You fight whatever shit sucking demon dragged you in here. You don't want to fight the hunter. He's not your regular demon. Follow me. Now. Oh, I want to fight the hunter. I definitely want to fight the hunter. All right, let's see what's over here. Oop. I can destroy shit, which ooh. Ah, uh, damn it! I can't get in there because I need a different weapon that you can unlock later. Yeah, there's replayability in this game, as in like you unlock weapons later, and when you do New Game Plus, you actually get to go through the game again with weapons you've already found. Oh, hey, cutie. These are lost souls. Souls trapped in limbo, free of the monitor, increase your mission completion bonus. They're pretty much pointless for this playthrough because I'm not like trying to get 100% or anything. Just doing a playthrough. And, um. I mean, they do give you uh, red orbs though, so that's good. Allows Dante to open a copper door. Copper door, or the doors, there's like copper door, silver door, and gold door. I think those are the only three. Let's see. Oh, there's like a platinum door too because you can see the, the keys held over there on the right side uh, shows all the keys that I have which I only have the copper one right now but they unlock uh, like copper door, silver door, gold door, etc and they're like challenge mode things and the higher up they are the more challenging they are but the higher the thing you get from them is some of them are really challenging I remember there was one I was stuck on for like a day I don't think it was a day, but it was it was a long time. Screw the Ferris wheel, or the whatever you want to call that flying diagonal carousel. I like to just go all combo crazy on these fuckers. Unless of course they're really close to it, <laughs> and it's more convenient to just flip them up like that. Whoop. Upgrade point received. Killing enemies and collecting white orbs fills Dante's upgrade bar. When the bar is full, Dante receives an upgrade point which can be spent at the shop to unlock new moves and abilities. The shop can be accessed from divinity statues during missions or from start mission start screen. If you say so, game. Whoa, that was awesome. Oh, I also got hit. I'm such a dick. I hit that flying sideways vertical slash diagonal carousel thing. I don't know what the fuck I was just saying there. Uh, gold orb can be used upon death to resort Dante. Gold orbs can also be purchased from the item shop. They're pretty fucking expensive, if I remember correctly. It's almost not worth doing it. Unless you really, really are having a problem with the part and you uh, know you need an extra life. Small vital store restores a small portion of Dante's health during gameplay. Press start and select items to use vital stores. Okay, for those of you familiar with Devil May Cry games, you'll know that those are pretty much everything that I've picked up so far is all a returning item that you can get. Oh, look, a divinity statue. This is basically the shop of the level. Um, let's do upgrades. 
Uh, we should upgrade. It's just my abilities, probably. Enemy step? No. Let's do attacks with my sword. Make the hacker thing more dangerous. Increase damage. Because you're, you'll be using that a lot, so I mean, you might as well. Gotta love the music for this game, just hope I don't get a copyright strike playing it. And yeah. It's another thing that's really inconvenient about going to fairs. Every time the Ferris wheel rolls away. Breaking news. We go live. That's a bitch. Those poor people. What I'm seeing. They had nothing to do with us. Oh well. At least they're not fighting demons. Oh shit. I think we come up there. Oh god. I fucked up. I had a good combo going and I done fucked it all up. Whoa! Did you see that? I think I deflected the... I think I could deflect them back. Maybe it was just a one time thing. Oh I did! I could deflect them back, that is fucking awesome. <laughs> nice! Come on! Let's go! I'm practicing my, uh... Batting. That is so kick-ass. Gonna have to remember that. Alright. What you got for me now? Oh, shit! Yeah, I think I'm gonna just run in here. Hopefully. Oh fuck! Okay, get off, get off me. Thank you. All right. Well, there's that, and uh, this is a good place to stop. So, thank you for watching, and then um, don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment, and because every like and subscribe helps, and. I will be bringing up more great content. And the comments are just for me to read because I love reading your guys' comments. I love reading everyone's comments. And I just want to know what you guys think of the game uh, throughout the playthrough. And um, yeah, or if you just want to say hey, go ahead and comment hey and I'll say hey back. Anyway, thanks for watching. Until next time, I'll subscribe to you. Bye. <laughs> Silence is a valid option. Good to know. You can't send me up. Walking the wrong way.